Hello everyone, in this video we are just going to discuss in detail about the hardware and software components that we are going to use throughout this course of complete programming in RL78 series microcontrollers. Let's get started. So first let us take a look into the hardware development board that we are going to use throughout this course. So this is the hardware development board which we are going to use throughout this course. So this development board is directly from the Renesis company itself. So the model number of the development board is QBR5F10PPJ-TB. So this one is the model number of the development board which will be provided from the Renesis company itself. And the IC that is located or placed in this development board is R5F10PPJ. So it is an 100 pin IC and QFP package. So we are just going to use this development board and we are just going to configure and utilize the microcontroller R5F10PPJ throughout this course. And additionally, we are having several features in this development board that we will be discussing in a, another video in future. And the emulator or the programmer that we are going to use for programming the IC as well as for debugging the microcontroller is Renesis E1 emulator. So this emulator, I think it is extended. So if you want to buy an emulator, you can buy E2 or E2 Lite emulator that is available in the market. But if you get this emulator, you can also buy this. That is not an issue. And if you are having any other development board with any other Renesis RL78 series microcontroller, you can also use that. The methods are same. That is all the methods that you will be studying in this particular course for configuring the microcontroller and also for interfacing various devices to the microcontroller are same for all the RL78 series microcontroller, Renesis microcontroller. So you can use any other development board if you are having any. And this is the basic connection that we are going to make for programming the microcontroller as well as for debugging the microcontroller. So I will be connecting the FRC cable from the E1 emulator, Renesis E1 emulator directly to the development board like this. And further, I will be connecting mini USB cable from Renesis E1 emulator to the PC USB port. So that I can directly program the microcontroller from the IDE that I am using to the microcontroller. And the software that we are going to use for configuring the microcontroller as well as for programming and debugging the Renesis RL78 series microcontroller is CS plus for CC. So the CS plus means CubeSuit plus. So this is the software or IDE provider from Renesis company itself. So I will be teaching you how you can download this IDE for free and you can use the light version of the software for dumping and playing around with the microcontroller and also for debugging the microcontroller of RL78, RX and RH850 in this IDE. But we will be using and utilizing only the compiler required for RL78 because we are just going to learn the RL78 series based microcontroller in this particular course. So I hope you got to know what are all the hardware and software components that we are going to utilize throughout this course. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching.